In this video, I'll be giving you all the details on this beautiful unit by my first wig, as well as trying out a new hairspray combo to see if this is the gots to be glue killer. If you're interested in seeing this detailed install, keep watching. Hello beauties, welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be reviewing this beautiful ash blonde highlight unit from my first wig. The unit that I'm reviewing is in 20 inches and guys, take a look at this beautiful coloring. Before I get into that, let me go ahead and give you the wig cap construction. It's a standard wig cap construction with the two combs in the front, one in the back, as well as the adjustable elastic band. So I'm going to go ahead and try this unit on so you could get into the details on how this unit was colored. So as always, you guys know, it's a My First Wig unit. It's going to come already pre-plucked. Now, what I love the most about this unit is the fact that it's ash blonde on top and then it's like brown on the bottom with these highlights throughout. It's really nicely done. If you guys don't know, My First Wig actually sends out their units to be colored by real stylist so you know you're going to get a professional job whenever you order one of their colored units so as i mentioned earlier i am going to be trying out this new hairspray combo i am always looking for a replacement for gots to be glue i've found several but you know it really just ends up that i always come back to using that one Okay, so the name of the lace spray that I'll be using today is an Extreme Firm Hold combined with the Extreme Mega Hold. And this is by Even New York. I have used their lace tint spray in the past. It's really good quality lace spray. I initially seen this review by Larea Andrea. She really had me excited to try this hairspray out because she says that it's sweat proof. So you know your girl had to go buy it and give her own review on how I feel this lace spray holds up. So the application that I'm using to apply this wig spray is I'm spraying the firm hold, letting that dry slightly, and then I'm going on top of that with the mega hold. Or vice versa, I really don't think it matters which order you do it. The general idea is that you layer these two hairsprays together. And what I'm doing is just combing this through with my comb to get that to press in with the lace as well as with the hair. Now, I decided I am going to add some very light baby hairs to this unit simply because it's a colored unit. I don't really particularly like colored units without baby hairs on me. But again, that's just a personal preference. You guys, as always, install your unit how you like it. Don't worry about what anybody else thinks. So I'm taking a thin layer of the hair to separate out from the rest of the unit and that's what I'm going to use for the baby hair. Then I'm going to go on top of that with my hot comb just to straighten that hair out. Next, I'm going to apply a light layer of that firm hold right on top of the lace in between where I've separated from the baby hair and the hairline. And then I'm taking my comb to gently comb that through because one of the things that I do like to do is I like to take, typically I would usually do this with the Gossipy Glue Spray, but I'm trying that with this. Take the spray and comb it and that kind of helps gives the hair kind of like this melted look and then you're just going to go on top of that and lay it down with your elastic band for about 10 minutes same spiel as usual and as you guys can see it's already given this unit a melted look now personally i feel like colored hair is the hardest to get to actually look melted simply because black hair just looks so sleek when it's melted so when you want to get the color here to look melted i feel like you got to work a little bit harder just to get that achieved but let me first tell you 
when I took that elastic band off, I was already shocked by the hold that I felt from this unit. Now, if you guys have ever used glue on your hair, you might notice that a hold from the glue and as compared to the hold from, say, a gossipy glue spray is completely different. Almost to the point where it kind of gives your eyes kind of like a chinky look when you're using the glue because it's really gripping the hair. And surprisingly, this combination of this hairspray gave me that feel. And I cannot say, I've tried a lot of different hairsprays and I can't say that if I actually tried any hairspray before this that actually gave me that snatched you know glue down feel after I laid my unit so so far so good I was very impressed with the hold from this spray combo and right here I'm just continuing to lay these baby hairs down I'm doing them a little longer than I typically do you guys know I like to go for the very natural short baby hair but you know i'll be trying to try different things out you know you don't want to always be doing things the same because how do you ever find anything new if you don't explore speaking of that i'm decided to actually wear this unit in the middle part and i found that i've been doing that a lot more recently now i'm not gonna say i like the middle part i mean i still don't really mess with middle part for me i think that the middle part is good on other people not technically for me but i'm getting a little used to it it's not as bad as it used to be before And guys, look at this melt, okay? Do you guys see this melt on this unit from this hairspray? It required the bare minimum. So real quick, I'm just gonna go through this hair lightly with my razor just to kind of get it to frame my face a little bit. And then I'm gonna go on top of that using some of this icy gloss spray just to add a little shine to this unit. And you guys can see this unit is really starting to come alive just like that. And I'm gonna take just a little bit of my foundation and go around the edges just to get everything to blend in with my makeup on my face. And then I'm also gonna take some of that concealer and apply that to the middle part area as well. And lastly, I decided I was gonna just add a couple of curls into this hair just to style it a little bit more because it actually kept most of the curls that it came with. So really had to do the bare minimum, which I love because you guys know, I like for my units to be almost ready to go, okay? And right here, I'm just adding that concealer to the middle part that I mentioned earlier. A couple more spritz of that hairspray and guys this unit is laid okay this unit is melted as if I used glue and I didn't I simply used hairspray when I tell you this unit was not budging this combo is the truth okay I'm just here to confirm if you was thinking about trying this combo out go ahead and get it before they raise the price on this and guys look how beautiful this unit is this is a my first wig unit so you know you're gonna get a good quality unit this is in 20 inches and I didn't really get any shedding for this unit at all I got a slightly tangling but that that's really just because this hair is bleached blonde and it's almost impossible to get blonde hair without having any tangling but guys I'm very happy with this install 
guys as always everything used in this video will be linked in the description box down below and before we get out of here guys i'm gonna need y'all help naming this wig go ahead and leave your name suggestions in the comment section down below and i did pick a name for the unit i reviewed last week the new name as well as the person who submitted the name will be listed across the screen so dolls if you found this video helpful go ahead and give it a thumbs up and make sure you hit that subscribe button before you leave and as always important until next time you guys stay blessed and if it be God's will, I'll see you in my next video. Take care now.